Surely happiness can be found Surely there's someone for me Oh, who cares? Yes, who cares for me? Good to see you, Hunter of the Wild. We are in Hirschfelden and look at this beautiful view. We're looking down at a lake. You can also see a cabin there. And we have one of the last story missions here to complete. There is an injured red deer stack, a huge animal that we have to go and shoot. The challenge will not be so much to find it and to track it down because it's gonna stand there. I've seen it before, but I thought what a way to just shoot it. I wanted to put this on film for you to see what does a huge red deer look like. It's got the scoring or the estimation mythical. And mythical means really it's a huge one. It, it's a diamond material. It might not end up being a diamond, but nevertheless, we want to go find it and have a look at this big red deer stack. So we'll jump right into the action. I put a tent up here. For those of you who have issues with the tents that are put away from some beaver that we hate by now, put it on flat ground and also fast travel to a cabin that is close to the tent before you come from a long way uh, somebody suggested the tent issue might be because it's a long fast travel from a different region uh, since i've been doing this i had no issues but now let's focus on the red deer there is a lot of roe deer here we might get some calls from roe deer bucks and those not likely from from the big red deer stack one chance that we might have though is when you start a game some a few minutes into the game there will also always be the message i found some tracks nearby so the game's gonna put you some tracks so you know at least where one of the animals is and i've done this before to go find it and it actually showed me where the red deer was the track that the game laid was exactly from the red deer but the chance is small since there's so many animals here there could be other red deer. There will almost certainly be other roe deer. I'm going to sneak all the way down towards the cabin. Let's have a quick peek at the map. I'm going to zoom all the way out. This is our beloved Hirschfelden. And up here in Rotwald, which is really the German word for red forest. Loads and loads of red deer. Fantastic area for hunting red deer. And this is the area where we have to find it. Sometimes you have to shoot an animal in the given area. Sometimes the area shown in a mission will just tell you where the animal is. But if you have to track it a long way and shoot it outside, it'll still complete the mission. And I believe this is one of those missions. It's just telling you roughly where the animal is. In case it ran and we had to track it down, we could still shoot it outside. I'm pretty sure of this. Yeah, there comes the first row deer call. There is a feeding area there. It's a mid-sized buck. Like said, calls will come from them. And the last time I found the stack, it was over there beyond the hut, over the hill. So I'm going to sneak all the way up to this hill. And then hopefully we can uh, locate the stack. And it really has a huge track. It's worth showing on video. I really don't see those animals uh, walking around. Uh, I don't think I've shot many red deer that score over 200. Trophy score. That's the score that I look at. And then of course you want the consecutive bonus and the quick kill bonus and the integrity bonus. But even if you mess those up, uh, still look at the trophy score uh, and be glad and happy about good scores. And don't worry too much about these bonuses. Whether or not this is going to score gold or diamond, I'm not too worried. I just enjoy hunting those big animals. And many of the missions really give you big animals. There is even an, an albino uh, brown bear which is really huge. It scores almost 29 points. That is in the uh, Medved Taiga. 
you will not likely see many of those when you play the game just like that but in missions you get those this is a mission animal like mentioned before um, so the challenge or yeah well the the goal here is not really finding these huge animals it's really just to go harvest it look at it hopefully we can spot it a little bit observe it a little bit i saw some tracks in that area earlier this morning hold on i'll send the coordinates and there is the mission so where did you find these tracks my lady uh over here you can see the green symbol the track that the tracks that she apparently found this morning are from the road here however i'm still pretty confident that the red steer will be just over that hill because they really place an animal in one spot and it's just gonna stand there sometimes it's almost stupid you have to just go to a particular place and shoot the animal down so it's not a big challenge the challenge here though is really you can spook the red deer if i'm uh, very exact i've been here twice before the first time i came i just saw uh, the uh, red deer run because i uh, i was not cautious enough the second time i came i shot it i actually killed it already looked at it from close looked at the rack and then thought well what a waste if you don't show this on video um, because most of us will not likely see uh, any of these mythical red deer stacks or at least not very often the wind is perfect at least right now it is it's in my face and animals really react very much on this wind you might have seen my yesterday's video where i shot a uh, albino fallow deer even though the wind was perfect it never came closer than 70 80 meters it was a huge buck well i say huge it was a big buck it ended up being a gold score uh, one of the biggest i've seen and shot and uh, it just didn't want to come any closer and even though the wind is uh, even though the wind was perfect there i hope i don't have to jump around here i can make it to the top of the hill what i can try is i can provoke a response call maybe It might react to that call but it's not likely gonna come much closer I had to turn down the volume of the game it's now only at 10% because of the very loud wind it's one of my wishes that they at some point find the time to really balance or rebalance the sound the wind really is too loud I see a lot of posts on Steam uh, from people telling the same. The same goes for rain. It's, it's okay to have the rain, but the sound itself is just killing everything. I'm sliding down now. This is not good. I really want to go up that hill. So I have to turn down the sound all the way to 10%. And you can see I'm going to a very particular point. This is where it was before. You can see my visibility indicator, the middle icon in the lower right, says that I'm practically invisible here underneath the trees. When I stand still, I got a flat line. So this is good. If the stag is down here, this will be helpful there it is look at this rack if you do this mission the first time it's gonna say there it is that is your stack yada yada and it's hurt you can see the weight estimation is 210 to 240 
That is the maximum weight that these red deer stacks get. It's an eight mythical. Oh, look at the score. 207 to 276. That is actually larger than the last time. That is great. And the challenge now will be to shoot it uh, on the spot. It should not run anywhere. And if it gives you a, an angle like this, this is not easy, but let's just let's just enjoy the rack. It's not a rack that you would see in nature unless they feed those red deer specifically. No, I don't really want to place the tent. Sorry about this. I want to have the binos. Special feeding will make them look like this. You will probably see them in hunting reserves in New Zealand, but not here in my place in Switzerland. We have those red deer stacks but not those many ends. Look at this, countless ends. Um, but how am I going to shoot it? How am I going to shoot it? If it's just going to stand like this, is it going to do anything with this call? Does that interest you in any way? Okay, so what we can tell now is at least... The animal will always be more or less in the same place. And if I mess up the shot, I can restart the game and come back here. It's going to be there because it's a mission animal. They will spawn where they're supposed to spawn. What I will try is if it looks away like this, I will try a neck shot with the 270. So I will get a 100% on consecutive. I will get a 100% on integrity. What I don't know is if I will get 100% on quick kill because it's already injured. So let's have a shot here at the neck. Come on, look down the hill as you did before. And it worked. It worked just nicely. There's our eight mythical, beautiful animal. And I'm really hoping for a high score. I'm really hoping for a, uh, for a diamond now. I'm going to collect it. So this will be my only chance. But since the score estimation is so high, I'm hoping for a diamond. I wish, I really wish I could sh show you the rack here, the beautiful big rack from up close. EW, if you are watching, please fix this. This is an issue with all the racks. Half of the racks or one of the antlers is always buried in the ground. Guys, this is not good. This is really not fun because we want to look at the whole rack. And one antler is always buried. We can only enjoy one half of it, one half of the antlers. Look at all these ends. I mean, if we count those, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and in the middle will be number fourteen on one antler. Fourteen ends. That just doesn't exist uh, in nature unless you help a little bit with special feet. Okay, we're going to collect it. So let's see if we can make maybe a quick trophy shot. Uh, put away. I I'll take out the binos and as I stow them away, I will have no hands and no binos visible. And that's the moment when I do the trophy shot. So I hit tap and shoot. Not sure if I was fast enough. Okay, this should do it. That's just beautiful. And here comes the harvest. You did a great job. I'll let Albertina know that you did Silver it. because of quick kill bonus. It's only silver because quick kill is 0%. It was already hurt. I wanted to hit the um, the neck and I hit the skull. I think I forgot to adjust the, um, the zeroing on the weapon. I shot too high. 
I did get one of the neck bones, upper neck. So that was actually lucky. I wanted to hit it down here a bit more below. Uh, so it worked out anyway. Integrity and consecutive is 100. Quick kill would have been 100 because it dropped on the spot. And now it's only a silver. Nevertheless, we could enjoy the big rack. And that was really the purpose of this. There you go. Huge red deer shot in the neck. This will make for a nice picture as well. All right. And I just quickly checked my cheat sheet. 208 trophy rating would not give you a diamond. That's only good for gold. Diamond would be 248, so even bigger. Wow. That's going, going to be one huge track if one day you find one of those. And for that, I wish you all the best. Hopefully you will find one of these huge red deer stacks. Otherwise, this is it for this video. Thank you very much. Stay in touch.